set up his cell for Sokolov in the old kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock, him waking up in the straw and old dog food. But from what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have it back. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in the shadows. The Royal Physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. He could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with a time. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. Attention, citizens. This evening, the streets that take the Pendleton Manor will be closed for a private ceremony following the tragic loss of two of our city's best and brightest. Please be as quiet as you can. It took forever for Emily to fall asleep. Poor dear. It's okay, Emily, I'm here. She seems happier when you're here. Though I know you have important things to do. Out there, in the city. She still has bad dreams, though it's understandable given all she's been through. Sometimes she calls out your name. Sometimes she cries for her mother. making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Callista will come get me when she's done with her bath. Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. Yes, he does. All we need is the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. It's very simple. I elect not to tell you. You will have to force the words from me, and I warn you, my willpower is quite legendary. Sorry, sir. No. Not right. Stop! Stop! I will tell you what you need to know! I'm obliged to safeguard Dunwall's greatest intellectual asset. I can only tell you so much. I was not permitted to see her face or hear her full name. She called herself Lady Boyle. You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party, it seems. 
A masked ball at the Boyle Estate. Tonight, the timing is perfect, Corvo. But the Boyles are wealthy and ruthless, so security will be very tight. Of course, you already have a mask, don't you, Corvo? Yes, you will be able to mingle with them once you're on the grounds. You'll have to find out which of the Boyle women is connected to the Lord Regent, and take her out whatever way you can devise. We're very close now. Corvo, if you do this tonight, we'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. you're off to the Boyle's little bash tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. In fact, he may be looking for me. Have you ever been in a sea battle? Of course. Did you ever see pirates? And did you sink me? Dance of investiture. I know it looks. I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers shaped like snowflakes. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just, you know, looking through the lock. I couldn't bear it if she knew. I know you're a man of honor, and I also know that you can kill me at any time. And for both of these reasons, I apologize and beg for your discretion. Can't you see I'm about to bathe? I understand. It was an accident. We have such a hard time maintaining privacy in such a crowded house, don't we? You require my unique services? We can quickly return to my shop. Masked ball. You happen to have the most clever mask. Everything was so fancy at the Golden Cat, but in a different way than the palace was fancy. 
The old Madame Prudence said that all the ladies are princesses and the men come to admire them. My doll, Mrs. Pilsen, was there the day my mother died. I bet Mrs. Pilsen would have liked it there. I hope she's safe, wherever she is. If I ever see my doll again, I'm going to declare a holiday across the Empire. Royal costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? 